Hey man, I'm Kevin Smith and I'm working on this new show, Hollyweed, with RivetTV.com. If you want to see more of Hollyweed, it is absolutely in your hands. Let's make this happen together. So all of a sudden, the dragon turns bad and he starts burning motherfuckers. And my little boy starts crying like, why, why Mr. Dragon, why? But I'm like, listen here, son. That dragon looks swaggy as a motherfucker. <laughs> Yo, the next time I watch this shit, you gotta watch it with me, man. This is the truth. How the fuck you laughing at me? There are no fucking dragons in Schindler's List. Fucking Google it. I'm not fucking Google it. You Google it. I'm fucking doing shit here, man. You don't believe me. Believe your motherfucking smartphone. Look at all the trimmings I got. You got none in your fucking bucket, and I gotta Google it. You need keywords? Schindler. Fucking, you got me so mad I misspelled Schindler. <laughs> I got a result here. I do. My bad. I went to Google, and I entered, are there dragons in Schindler's list? And fucking Google laughed at me, because there are no fucking dragons in Schindler's list, man. Can I go back to work now? Ain't no dragons in Schindler's list. What were you smoking? Let's start there. Your baby. Really? God damn it, man. You know what this means, Snaps? This is some good weed. What are you gonna call a plant that beautiful? I don't know, man. I was thinking about that. Let's go basic. We grew the shit right here in Hollywood. Is weed. What do you call weed that you grow in Hollywood? Morning and I check my stash. Just some shake, wake and bake on some Moroccan hash. Go to the dispensary, patient of the century. Need a nice sativa that will stimulate me mentally. Buds with sticky density of moderate intensity. Pipe like Sherlock Holmes, cause the sweet is elementary. Welcome, friends, to the dispensary. God, I wanna fuck every one of these beautiful buds. You got the best job in the world, Pete. Sitting on top of all this organic treasure, like your smog. Wow, it's all dragon talk today. It's so weird. It's all dragons when you're living La Vida screenwriter, amigo. Are you serious? Are you a screenwriter and I didn't like know it? You seen that Revenant movie? Fuck out of here. You wrote The Revenant? No. I wrote a tweet about The Revenant that was on TV during the Oscars. That's Beyonce, nigga. <laughs> When's the last time you ever had a screenplay made into a movie? Including last year? Okay. None? No. Yeah. Never? No. Yeah. All right, I will have me an eighth of the anal destruction. Ugh, dude, anal destruction is the worst name strain in Los Angeles. Fuck you, anal destruction is in memory of my mama. You don't want to buy no anal destruction. Anal destruction is our dickweed this week. Dickweed? What's that? It sounds hot. Basically, it's our worst strain. We give it the most metal names. So all the Saturday stoners and the posers come through the door looking for the edge. That's what we sell them, man. It's dickweed. Hey, yo, Pete. Yeah, hold on. I'll be right back. I'm telling you, Pete, I know my mother used to use religion to save money when I was younger, man. Ow. Look, every time we got close to a holiday, she changed our religion. Two months before Christmas, I'm a fucking Muslim. <laughs> Two months before my motherfucking birthday, I'm a goddamn Jehovah Witness. I'm like, I want a motherfucking toy. I'm a fucking kid. <laughs> what you throwing out? What? Shut the fuck up! Dude, Jesus fucking Christ, bro! Ooh, you almost got fucked up. Fuck, dude, it's just us. We're just throwing out the branches. Branches? My high? <laughs> Seriously. Come on, dude. You know way better than this guy. I thought he was on to something. Are you huh? fucking kidding me? He lives next to our dumpster, Nips. <laughs> Rolo. Me and Pete got a little bet. Rolo. Is that your first name? Or is that your last name? Rolo? It's my superhero name. Superhero name. We never even considered that when we're such idiots. That's really sweet, dude. If Rolo is your superhero name, what's your secret identity? It's a secret. Of course. I'm just like yours and yours. I got a secret identity? We all got secret identities, black man! <clears throat> secret identity is who you really are. Not the shit the world sees. That is, that's seriously, like the most beautifully profound thing I've ever heard in my life. Profoundly fucking stupid. But you know what, Rolo? We got a bunch of edibles about to expire in a couple days. Why don't you come inside and help us eat them? Oh shit, yes, after I shower in the sink. 
Well, I didn't say you could shower in a pool. Come on, Pete, I drink out of that fucking sink. Well, maybe you shouldn't drink out the fucking sink. What were we just talking about? Compassionate fucking care. If we're not here to help people like that, what the fuck are we here for? Fuck compassion care. I'm here to get high. Lock that location, fucker. The script calls for a mansion, all right? And we're slaves to the script. Hey, bro. Sorry, I said slaves. All right, what kind of meds can I get you today, my friend? Meds? No, okay? I'm looking to get baked, bros. Okay. Right? So what I would want, I guess, to do that is a pint of the best stuff you got. Skews, skews. Guys, I'm at the pot store right now and they're asking me all sorts of crazy tired questions. And I just need to know how much weed does this bitch want so I can get the fuck out of here? A fuck ton, how much is that? Okay. Okay, how about this? How about this? Seen that much before? It's a fatty. Give me as much as that gets me, the best stuff. Didn't know you were a serious connoisseur. B, man wants the best stuff, going to safe. Three ounces of anal destruction. Oh, you hear that? Get ready for some anal destruction. Fuck's David O'Sell's dick. You mean asshole? <coughs> yeah. Left. Motherfucker had the nerve to ask me, do we do home <coughs> delivery? Delivery? We're not fucking dominoes. We are dominoes where the motherfucker wanna pay double. We doing home delivery. You going to the valley. He paid you more now, I gotta go to the valley? I don't wanna go to fucking valley, dude. I don't wanna go to the valley. You know what my mother used to tell me? Get this. When I was younger, I didn't want to do what the fuck she told me to do. <coughs> my mother. The lady gave me everything. The lady that press fed me in a motherfucking blizzard, nigga. You know what she would say to me? You better do what the fuck I told you to do. Or I'm electrocute your ass with a fucking hot plate. Oh, fuck your white people problems. Let me see you do it like this. Do it, do it like this. You ain't, you ain't never seen nobody do it like this. Do it, do it like this. Do it, do it like this. You ain't, you ain't never seen nobody uh, do it uh, like uh. this. You can find me with a DJ spinning. Uh, I was trying not to lose that. Hey, man. I was. Hey. Hi. I'm looking for a guy named Brent. Come in. Hey. hey, what is up? I got my test and I'm in the clear. So uh, you wanna see my pussy or what? Uh, yes, no, like, why, uh, why, why do you ask? Wait, you got the bag, you're the doctor, right? Oh, the bag, no, man, I'm sorry, I'm not a doctor. Oh. Well, then I guess I shouldn't be waving my vagina all around at you then, huh? <laughs> I mean, you can. That'd be, like, awesome. Wow, I'm sorry, that was wholly inappropriate. Okay, let's focus. What's happening here? I'm sorry, I'm... They told me Video Vi Village was here. I'm just looking for a guy named Brent for this. Okay, I know Brent, he's a fucking douche, but I can show you to him. Come with me if you want to live. Okay. Have you seen Brent? Brent. Oh my God, this is you, man. You're on the cake. This this is your birthday. All day, dude. Happy birthday, girl. I just met. I'm I'm Pete. Hi, Pete. I'm Brookline. Brookline, Mass. Brookline, Mass. Come on. It's a town like right when, outside of Boston. That sounds like a fucking poor name. If I've ever heard a poor name in my life. Mm hmm. It is a poor name, Pete. That's what this, God, I feel like an asshole. How did I not know that? There's so many people in robes here. Nuts, Nipsey didn't tell me. Just gave me an address, man. I thought this was like a movie movie. Well, welcome to Porn Pete. In this movie, I'll be having the sex. 
Fuck, man. Don't ruin the movie for me. So sorry. You gotta say spoilers first. Don't you know etiquette? Spoilers. The men are gonna come. <laughs> Not the women, though. Don't be fooled. Right on, well. Make them rain. I mean, <laughs> ew, God, I'm so sorry. That is so not the context. You know, I should get out of here. I'm way too old for this. What is the way to get out? Because you guys might start shooting soon, and I, I, like, I'll be honest with you, I don't want to get hit. Well, we're not going to start shooting until the weed gets here, because I'm not doing this shit until I'm high as fuck. You know what? I ain't leaving either until the weed guy gets here. That's a good idea. I'm sticking around. Where's that goddamn weed guy? Oh! You know what? It's me. Get the fuck out. I love you, my new friend, Pete. Ugh. <clears throat> I smoke with the poor, but I give to the needy. <clears throat> I save some, I smoke some, cause I'm never greedy. Share, nigga. We got what you want, no need to ration. I'm not like my nigga, Pete. He's got too much motherfucking compassion. Fire! Come to my shop and get what you need. Ain't nothing like anal destruction if it's Hollyweed. Mmm! Wu-Tang forever, nigga. Bars. Oh, nigga, we gonna get rich off this shit. Well, 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 the pot store guy's finally here. Getting very predatory with my leading lady. Pot store guy or Pete? Fuck names. You got that weed I overpaid for or what? Brookline. Is this old fuck bugging you? This old fuck is getting me high so I can shoot your fucking deeper, so chill it out. Yeah, and I'm sorry, old? Hey, hey, it's not my deeper, okay? It's yours. Ew. It's yours. Like, fucking ooh me. Ew, ew, you know what? It's her birthday. How about being a gentleman? Don't tell me what fucking date it is and whose name is what guy. Why don't you fuck shit and get off my set, all right? Fuck shit? <laughs> I own a gun. I'll have you know, I'm a proud gun owner. Don't make me be the hard guy. Okay, look, I don't want to get all lectury in front of the lady, but- You're getting super lectury. Guns don't make people hard. What? Guns don't make a man hard. You believe this? Are you hearing this guy? Just leave us the fuck alone, Brent. Come on, I'll shoot him good and ready. And shoot you. You got a target on your back now. Get her baked, pot guy. Couldn't help but overhear the man you work for, Brent. Uh huh. Say deeper, the deeper. That's a new one to me. But I'm assuming. Uh, uh, is that related to the? Yep, I am shooting my first DP today. Ah. Yep. DP. Uh huh. I actually have a picture of the DVD. We just took it here. Hang on. Wow, that's a whole lot of, let's do another, oh, well that one's pretty, you know? The other one was a little too much lips, whatever, I don't know, it's just kind of, wow, this this is what we're doing today. Mm -hmm. Very Boston theme. Watch Beantown, Bad Girl, Brookline, Mass. That's a lot of alliteration, isn't it? Real classy. Take one in her green monster. Oh my gosh, you're bush green right now? You saw it earlier. <laughs> uh, and take one up her old mass hole. See? Well, that's kind of clever. Mm -hmm. That's a lot of Boston talk. You're going to need a fucking doctor to get rid of all that Boston talk. Oh, man, I am high as fuck. <laughs> Me too. What's that shit called? Hollyweed. Hollyweed. I like it. What is it, a sativa? Uh... You don't even know what the other one is, do you? The other one, <laughs> yeah, you what is it? What is it? I was just gonna let you hang there for a long time. <laughs> I've seen some of these, what do you call it? The prawns? That's what the kids call it? Mm -hmm. Whenever there's a DP in it, looks like it fucking hurts like hell, man. Am I crazy or what? It's all good. I've been doing some anal exercises. Wow, you trained your asshole, man. Just like that little boy trained that dragon <laughs> in that movie. Mm -hmm. You have to be the richest person I know. All right. DP. So what, like, just out of curiosity, like, what do they pay for that kind of thing? Guess. Fuck, I need to think. I didn't know I'd be doing math. Go ahead, guess. 
million dollars. 3500 $3,500 million. Fuck, God bless you, kid. No, $3,500. What? Without... $3,500? And then it goes down if you keep doing it. Second time, $1,600. It goes down? Porn's all about going down, dude. Who the fuck wrote this? Charles Dickens? You fucking doing that on your birthday is straight out of Dickens, but just way more fucking dick. And dude, you are so baked right now. Fuck yeah, I'm baked. I'm, I'm fucking, we've been smoking weed for hours. Of course I'm baked, but you instantly harshed my mellow. <laughs> How am I ever supposed to watch a DP in good conscience again. Why would you watch a DP anyway when you could watch some like, I don't know, Ant-Man? I mean, fuck a DP, homie's tiny as fuck. Oh my God. Don't get creeped out, but you know what? Yeah? Let's just go. We can't go. Yeah, do you want, like, fucking, let's get out of here. You want to leave? Leave? Fucking, yeah, I think so, yeah. Do you see how many people are here? The camera crew, there's like 20 people waiting on me. I can't just go. I mean, well, you know, with all due respect to, the, to your industry, fuck these people. Are you fucking crazy? I ain't gonna tell you your business, but you should maybe never fucking think about doing this in your life. But I know one thing to be fucking sure, you should never fucking do it on your birthday, man. Why do you care so much and keep your voice down? I don't know, because like, look at you, you're funny and shit. And like, why don't you care? You should care more. I can't leave you here. That's like horrible karma. Like, I can't let you do this. Okay, like I can tell by your blank expression that I'm either you're very baked or I'm not reaching you. Either way, I feel like I gotta put it on fucking Front Street. Okay. Come with me if you want to live. Where are you? We have to shoot. God. Brookline! One for the money, for the money. money. Give me two for the show, for the show. show. Got yachts on deck, on deck. Uh, tell me where you want to go. Where you want to go? This is really sweet, man. Thank you. I'm blowed out, man. Make it official. Let's go. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> it's a one hitter. Well done. Happy birthday, Brookline. Oh, um, my real name is Janet. Uh, Brookline's my porn name. Janet? Yep. Really? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Janet's, um, it's my secret identity. <laughs> Not today, nigga. Come on, what the fuck? Put that down, dude, put it down! Fuck, man, you almost got your ass shot. Jesus fucking Christ. You almost got a motherfucking cap on your ass, son. You better shoot me in the fucking face before you ever send me the valley on a goddamn delivery again. You know that was a porn shoot you sent me to? It was? Yes, and before I can get out of there, one of the porn stars pulled my dick out, sucked it a little before I could run away. She did. She did, it was a fucking dude! It was? Yes, and I'll blame you. Why? Why? Because you set me for a delivery, man. I don't want to do that shit now. I'm all sexually confused. I'm going to tell you right now, Nipsey, you're going to hire somebody else or I fucking quit. Okay, fuck it, Pete. I fucking hire somebody, man. When? The minute we find a fucking girl, man. Okay? Good, because I found a girl. Is Brookline in the house? Where Brookline at? Where, Where Brookline, Brookline at? at? What the <laughs> fuck? Oh, Nips, Nips, no, 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 no man. She's with me. She's what? with me. No more guns. No more guns. Put it down. Fuck. Say call of duty, man. Come on in, Janet. He ain't gonna shoot you. Nipsey, this is Janet, who I met today, and she's amazing, and I'm pretty sure she may be this place's missing piece. Janet's about to miss a piece of her fucking ass. You can't fucking sneak up on me like that. Let me tell you what happened. I think we're onto something special, man. Smoking Hollyweed changed this girl's life today. Tell him about it. Yeah, that way's all right. Yeah, see what I'm saying? It made her quit her job, so I figure we need help here. Maybe we can give her a job right here. Fuck! No! You literally just a few minutes ago said you were gonna hire somebody. Did you not say you were gonna hire somebody? Remember Okay, that? okay, okay! You wanna work here? You know, Pete is a weed whiz. I'm the hard guy, okay? Hard guy. Guns don't make you hard, dude. 
Everybody that works here has to be good at something. So, Miss Thang, at your last job, what were you good at? Anal. Wow! Woo! Welcome to LA Confidential. When do I start? Start tomorrow. You can make a living doing voices, man. Oh, Pete, look a little thin today, bro. Do I? Thank you, man. It's crazy. Yesterday, I felt real bloated and stuff. This morning, though, I got up, took a huge shit, feel like I lost 40 pounds. Too much information, bro. My bad. This is adorable. What's this? Yo, Pete, <laughs> get this. Tell him. Tell him your name. My name is Jeff. Jiff, really? Like the peanut butter? That's what I thought. No, get this, Pete. Tell him his name. His name is Smuckers. Smuckers? Oh, my lord, I'm so jelly. I wish that was my name. That's ridiculous. <laughs> we were doing dabs when we came up with it. But hey, I kind of like it. With a name like Smuckers, you have to be good. <laughs> <laughs> Trademark, that's good. Yo, listen, Jeff came all the way from Woodland Hills because in Woodland Hills, she's part of the church group. Oh, really? Man, I'm sorry about that. So what, like you have to come over here to buy your weed because you don't want to buy weed in the same town where you go to church, is that it? No. The church people sent her here. What? Fucking like church people sent you? Why? And I got $3,000 of people I don't even like's money roaming all around Los Angeles oh. because I smoked some of the best flower of my life last night. What flower did you smoke? Duh, Holy weed. Hollyweed? The fuck out of here, Hollyweed made it all the way to Woodland Hills. I feel like I'm fucking famous. I'm like the Brad Pitt of weed. What are we doing out here, man? She got a fat wad of cash. Open the gates, let's get in and sell her some product. You got your keys? I mean, yeah, I got my keys, but you got your keys, right? No, no, you lost your keys, bro. I lost my keys. When did I, when did I lose my keys? Last night, you sent Janet to my place at 2 o'clock in the morning asking for my keys so you get your doctor's bag. You don't remember that? Nips, I didn't do that last night. Do Fuck! No. No! No! Fuck! Check the money. Oh, fuck. How did she fucking take everything? Fuck! The money's gone too, Pete! Fuck! Check the plants. Man! Fuck! Dude, this sucks. Yeah. Hey. When times get their hardest, let Christ be the light. Fuck Christ. Fuck! Guns don't make you hard, dude. Well, that's kind of cute, no? <laughs> no, it's not cute. What about the plants, man? Did she take the plants? No, she didn't take the plants. Okay, okay, well that's good. The plants here, that's a good thing. No, no, it's not good. I had $10,000 in that fucking drawer, bro. I was supposed to deposit that into the bank today. You know what's gonna happen? All those fucking checks are gonna bounce. You know what they're gonna bounce like? Two big titties. I can't help but feel like this is kind of my fault or something. It is, motherfucker. Nipsey, we got a horror porn star. Oh, Nipsey, she's the missing piece. Look, look around. You know what's missing? Pieces of my motherfucking money. That's what's missing. We got robbed, B. What's this? Maybe it's a check to cover all the shit she stole. No check. Fuck, man. <sighs> Dear Pete, everybody I ever met out here only ever took what they wanted from me and moved on. But yesterday, you were the first person who gave me something. You gave me a minute to think. When you took me off that set, I had a chance to really look at my life, and I hated what I saw. So I'm gonna go back home and start over again. You saved me, Pete, just like a superhero with a secret identity. You made it so I didn't have to fuck anybody for once, except I wound up fucking you, and not in the way I would have liked with your dick in me. Sorry I took all your money. I'm gonna use it to go back to school. Love, Janet. P.S. Watch Ant-Man. Homie gets tiny as fuck. Really sweet note, you wanna read it? No, I don't wanna read that fucking note, man. Sorry. Hey, Pete! I've been thinking about it all night. 
and I want some anal destruction. It's another hit bite. Smoking on the blunt like E.T. Fangers. It's another hit bite. Smoking on the blunt like E.T. Fangers. Clouds of smoke circulate through my throat till I start to choke and float like a boat. E.T. Fingers, please phone home. So I can take a token, get full blown. Off a of bomb, autumn tree, OG Mel Rose. Swish her fresh out the box like Adidas shell toes. Rivet TV is audience powered television, where we give you the power to greenlight all new originals from some of the most creative talent in entertainment. Here's how it works go to rivettv.com and watch an all new pilot episode for free. And if you want to see the rest of the season come to life, choose the price per episode you want to pay. If you pledge more, fewer people are needed to greenlight the show. The more people who pledge, the less it costs for everyone. So give your friends a free episode of a great new show, and together, we'll bring it to life. With Rivet TV, you'll get more than just a show. Go behind the scenes with insider updates from the show's creators so you can experience production from start to finish. Watch it, price it, share it. With Rivet TV, you run the show.